up YouTube and I'm here to help you how to resolve a problem commonly for Steam players, some Steam players and this question or more likely this problem has been arising a couple of months ago, more likely years ago and as I can see when I was searching to Google the problem was not that solved. I mean there's no permanent solution to the said problem. So maybe I could help somehow. I'm not saying that this would be effective for all for all of you, but I hope this might help you. So for instance, um uh in this uh, I already fixed mine because I encountered the problem, the same problem um hours ago and I tried to troubleshoot it and I, it really didn't work out for me, like I tried rebooting it, I, I tried to um, reconnect or something, but no can do, log off, log, log in, no. So what I did was, um, I go to my Steam and then go to my settings and go to the account panel and you can see here your account name, contact email, back status, security status, your manage, change, blah 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 and so on and so forth. So you might want to go to your manage Steam Guard account and security. So you just have to wait. And you'll be here in this window. So there's an option that will lead you to remove Steam Guard Authenticator, get back a Steam Card codes, and if you are concerned for your credentials, save another device. So they authorize all all the devices. So I would like to click on the authorize all of the devices. So what is the main reason why are we going here? So probably one of the main reasons why you cannot go online on your Steam account is probably your account might be logged on into another computer or another laptop or a device. So you might want to do this so that you can actually remote it to automatically log it off. So that will help you a lot. In my case, what I did was I did this and I noticed that um, it worked totally fine for me. So yeah, so you just have to click the authorize all other devices and you'll be sure that your accounts in other laptop or PC would be logged out. And one more thing, um, this thing will not actually log you off from your mobile device. For example, those people who are using Steam Guard in their phone, um, for what I know, it will not um, actually log you off from there because it's your authentication or more likely your confirmation if you are the one really opening your account, right? So I think it will not log it off. So if if it did, um, I think it won't be really a problem. Second option is that you can actually change your password. You can actually go again to the settings and actually go to your account and of course change your password. Changing your password will force, force all the accounts open to another device to actually re to retype the password and requiring them to log it off. More likely the system will log it off automatically. So change the password and you'll be assured that it will log it off from other devices. So yes. So Next, there's another problem arising. Well, actually, I think this is a pretty common. Well, for some for some players there, you might have actually encountered a problem where you can actually see that there's a Steam warning when you're starting a game. Like, Steam was unable to sync your files for Dota 2 or, for example, whatever game you're having um, with the Steam Cloud. And then it's gonna say like if you have launched this application from another computer, your application settings and or progress may not be in sync with what is stored in the cloud. If you launch this, I mean if you launch the application now, you might lose those changes or progress. Well, that's gonna lead you to two options where if you still want to play the game or cancel. So if you did attempt to play the game, um you are logged off, like you're in offline mode, even though you have a perfect running connection. I had that problem earlier with my Dota 2 as I've said and it really pissed me off. So if you if ever that you encounter the same problem you might want to go to Dota 2 right click or in whatever game you've had and go to properties and in this you have to go to the local file tab 
And you can see here there's browse local files, backup game files, delete local game content, and verify integrity of game KK. And I will actually go here to the verify integrity of game KK. This will actually refresh the game settings on your computer, proving the cloud sync or more likely the save file you are playing in is the main one. More likely, in some other cases, when you play into another computer, more likely if you're playing in other computer shops or maybe if you're playing in a friend's house, um, you are somehow merging with this cloud save. So that would really make the cloud save a little bit crazy. So you will want to do this thing. And I think that would actually solve the problem. For example, if you're on a game, for example, in Dota 2, just like I've said, so that's going to be a bit of a problem. So. Um, you might want to actually let the game finish because um, in my case earlier when I was having the same problem I waited for the game to finish before I actually played the game because um, my Dota 2 was forcing me to reconnect so I think that would fix the problem so hope guys it helped you and if you have other questions or other comments please comment down below and Tell me if, uh, if this was helpful or if it's not. You can actually post your comments on what happened if uh, when you did the same process as I did. And we will find the right answer. So, hope guys I helped you. And cheers for all those who watched this video. I hope it helped you. And once again, I'm Sapiro. And I will be gladly help you in whatever problems you have so just post it in your comments please hit like and subscribe to my videos and I will make sure that I will give you the best quality videos that you would like so peace